so this is how I'm gonna start the video, okay? It's Wednesday. Today I'm releasing finally the first video since like I had this long break. I was supposed to edit the footage, take a break from filming, edit the footage to catch up with editing and I did neither. Got over this whole situation. I decided to move forward, forget about that footage. It's a little bit sad because I put a lot of effort into it and I have a lot of footage there but maybe one day for whatever reason we'll see the light of day but we're moving forward. We're moving on. Look what I said. Okay, you know nothing about this, I don't think. I ever mentioned this in on this channel on YouTube, but I am trying to build a business where I sell my planners that I make. So I make the planners. I don't print them. I'm using print on demand services for a couple of reasons. One, it's cheaper for me, less complicated while I can test out different products and test out my own creativity when it comes to designing planners. You know, I don't have to worry about stock and if I order too many items and then they don't sell and whatever. Also, it is environmentally better. This is, I think, the third year that I'm releasing my yearly planner, calendar, agenda, scheduler. I don't know how you, you know, different people call it differently. I'm not sure what the actual term would be, I think, planner. That's what I've always called them, planners. Initially, it was supposed to arrive January. Now it's 27th of December, so it actually ended up arriving sooner. I'm very happy about that means that I can do my 2024 planning now and also I can take the pictures before the new year and I can um, post more pictures and more videos on social media. I need to film unboxing, that's for sure. That's why it, I didn't open it yet. And a flip through. And then if creativity hits me, maybe I will do something else, but I'll show it to you when it's out of the box. I decided to just do it now because there is natural light, which I need for this video. And also I'll just get it done and then I'll have it and then I'll have time to edit and stuff like that. So I have this thing. It's like a tripod. I, it's not really a tripod. I don't. I don't know what it's actually properly called, but it's this thing that you attach to a table, and then you know there is this long leg, I guess, and then here's where you put your phone. I will be filming everything on my phone because I needed to be vertical for TikTok and real Instagram reels, um, and I have a tripod, but I need it to be like a top you so the tripod is not going to work for that but this will i will just attach it not to the table because it's too short so i will attach it there is like a window right in front of me here and my table is right over here so i think i'm gonna attach it to the window um and then somehow try to make this work so but first i have to clear the table because there is a lot of stuff here This is my laptop stand, a box from the projector. <laughs> this is where I'm going to film. Okay, this could work. I film it like this, I could film it like this, but then I would not have enough. Okay, change of plan. Um, I also could open the window a little bit. I think I'm gonna do that actually. Yeah. And that's just improvising, I guess. It needs to be absolutely, like, perfectly. I can also move the I think I'm ready. I just need to plan. Obviously, when you unbox something, it's you have only one shot at it. So what I like to do is I like to just plan my movement. It's probably very noisy because it's windy outside, but I need the window open. I need to plan what I'm gonna do, which side I'm gonna put it into the frame, where I'm gonna cut it, how I'm gonna open it, and I need to make sure that I know exactly 
like where I'm putting everything so it's not out of frame. You keep disappearing because you're in front of the window, but so the plan is I'm gonna slide it into the frame and I think it will be a nicer shot if I cut it and open it like this. Yeah, okay, let's just do it. Take a second to appreciate it. Here it is. <laughs> I'm just gonna film a little bit more. I will make as many shots as I can, flipping through it, you know, and stuff like that. Okay, so this is done now. Um, I feel much, much better because it's been on my to-do list for quite a while and now I'm going to do some work and then I think I'm just going to edit the videos that I have I'm going to look through it now but I think it all looked fine because I was watching it all the entire time Welcome to my orange bathroom I have a few things that I would like to accomplish today. I don't know if I can accomplish all of it. I need to fix my nail because one of them just popped off yesterday. I wanted to do some planning in my new planner that I received that you saw in the previous clips. I would love to have more stickers for it because I, when I plan I also sometimes like to film and do like a plan with me video that I then post on social media. The nail needs to come first because if I am filming then I would like to have all of my nails done. For the then I would like to prep some food for next week. And one of the things that I want to do is ginger shots because I bought a bunch of ginger and lemon yesterday. So I'm about to start straightening my hair. That's why I look like this. Another thing that I would like to do is, and I know that this is where it kind of starts becoming unrealistic, that I will accomplish all of this in one day today. I'd love to work on my planner business and just plan the social media posts. Ideally, plan the content for an entire month of January, but also make and schedule the posts for next week. On top of that, I also would like to work on this, on these videos on this channel and also do the same, plan my content. Part of that also is I'm, I'm trying to figure out what kind of challenge I want to do next, because like I mentioned in my previous video, I'm not giving up on the idea of doing a challenge and I actually really liked doing the previous one even though i didn't complete it fully but i you know it really helped me in terms of motivation in terms of that like extra push i would really like to tackle and work on my diet and this is something that i did quite successfully in the four weeks that i did that challenge you know it worked really well and parts of that challenge was cutting my portions in half and that worked really well. I definitely want to do that again. I'm trying to think how to do it. I don't, I don't know if I should just do a challenge with just diet. So for example, maybe counting calories, maybe doing intermittent fasting, maybe doing cutting 
you know cutting the portions i don't know for the videos if that would be enough content and i do have to think about that because that's what i would like to do i would like to incorporate it into my videos that's what i wanted to do today i wanted to figure it out get all my ducks in a row and sort of plan exactly what i'm gonna do and how i'm gonna do it so that was something i wanted to tackle today as well first i wanted to sit down as well and play with my planner a little bit and just you know organize it and stuff like that and prep it for the for next week and for the new year because next week is january already so i would like to sit down and kind of map out my year a little bit i don't like to plan too much in advance i actually just can't my brain doesn't work like that but you know just like the things that i want to happen or i think will happen next year like my move hopefully will happen next year you know um, so I would like to start thinking about that a little bit more like when I'm gonna start planning the move when I'm gonna book the tickets all that jazz when I'm gonna start looking for like jobs or apartment or you know stuff like that so as you can see there is a lot on my to-do list and I think that's everything like there is nothing else that really needs to be done in terms of like self-care or anything like that like a, I took my big shower yesterday I did my face mask a few days ago you know like there's nothing really i'm straightening my hair now so that's gonna be done okay hair done and now on to the ginger shop <laughs> put enough water because I only ended up with one two three seven of them and I was hoping that I would have a little bit more Thank you for coming on this journey with me. Hi, Christmas tree. I do want to sit down and plan my future content now that I, the ginger shots are done. <laughs> I would like to sit down and actually go through all of my ideas and everything that I want to do on this channel and with my videos and also for my business. And I want to plan my content a little bit more. I think I've figured out 
kind of what I want to do with the challenges and stuff like that moving forward. I'm gonna end this video here. Thank you so much for watching it. I had a good week. I hope you did too. I hope you had a great good holidays. And I don't know when I'm gonna pick up the camera exactly. I'm thinking I might film workouts next week, just like a full week of workouts that I do. Oh my god, this is gonna be interesting filming in the gym, but anyway. Anyway, I'm getting ahead of myself <laughs> and also I'm just rambling at this stage. Thank you so much for watching. In the next video, hopefully I can give you a little bit more information about the challenge that I do. Maybe I will even start it in the next video already. Who knows? Subscribe if you, you know, found this interesting or if you're interested in, you know, weight loss content or fitness content or any other content around, I guess, lifestyle and cooking and meal prepping and stuff like that because this is what this channel is going to be about and in about um you know three to six months this channel is also going to be about moving countries and also hopefully about decorating and getting settled in a new apartment and moving apartments and moving cities and all that good stuff so subscribe if any of that sounds interesting to you uh, like this video if you like this video and I'll see you next week on Tuesday. Bye!